Hello. Hey guys. Good afternoon. Welcome back to our YouTube channel and today today we have a big thing for you guys. So, we found this place where they make furniture out of grass reeds that grow in the lake. And the edging on the furniture to make it really strong and keep it together is made out of hyacinths, reeds. It's so interesting and we really hope you guys are going to enjoy today's video as we take you around and show you this amazing place beside the road where they make amazing furniture sets, they make baskets. Um, I even saw a few pottery, pottery um, jars and they do paintings just incredible art that has been passed down from generation to generation. The man that is making the couch with the reeds, he told us his dad taught him. So it's just an amazing experience and I hope you guys will enjoy it. Come along.
My name is Sylvia. Yeah. And what is your name? My name is David Omondi. David Omondi. Yeah. Okay, David. Today we came here to show the skill that you have. Yeah. So where are you getting these materials from? Okay, you get this one from the lake. Okay. Yeah. So are they like the reeds, the grasses that grow? Yeah, it's uh, the papyrus reeds. Papyrus reeds? Yeah, papyrus reeds. Okay. Yeah, it's from the lake. So we get them from the lake. Mm -hmm. We peel them um, uh, uh, into three pieces. Mm -hmm. And then we roll it. You roll it? Yeah. Oh, and I then, can see they are twisted. Yeah, they are twisted. Okay. Yeah, and then we put them from the sun. Uh huh. From the sun. After from the sun, we put them from the. If you if you want to use, we put from the water uh -huh. to be soft. Okay. Yeah, and then we use. Okay, and yeah. then after they are from the water, yeah. it's when you start braiding them into this pattern here. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. And these ones are the same way? Uh, this one is uh, water hyacinth. Oh, the water hyacinth. Yeah. Or what you use for the edging. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's from the legs. It's, this one is from the legs. Okay. Yeah. And those are also twisted. Yeah, we twisted. It makes them strong. Yeah. Okay. Make them strong. Yeah. Okay. And then after you've uh, braided them and put everything together, you apply something to keep the rain from yeah, yeah, yeah. disturbing it. Yeah, among yeah. You. We we just varnish. Just oh, you the varnish, varnish it. Yeah. yeah. Okay, you varnish it, and then you also include pillows, or yeah, we we put the pillows uh. yeah, and cushions. So, how long does one of these last before you have to again remove the reeds and put new ones? Um, after 15 years. 15 years? Yeah. If you take good care of it? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Your work is so nice. Thank, Thank you. you for letting us come here today and film what you do. Yeah. We appreciate Omundi. Thank you. Erokamanu Maduang. Erokamanu Aika. So how many years have you been doing this? Mm, five years. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Wow, that's so great. And who taught you? My dad. Your dad. So it's a family business. Yeah, it's a family business. Wow. Yeah. That's good. Is your dad still alive? No. No. So he passed on this this work to you. Yeah. yeah. Wow. That's so good. And your son will also be learning one day, Cindy. Yeah. Okay. Such a peaceful place to have a job. Yeah. <laughs> so approximately a whole set, he's saying a five-seater, goes for $350 if you get it with the cushions and everything installed. If you get it without cushions, it's going at $250 USD. And he's saying that you can negotiate the price. So, welcome to Kenya. <laughs>